With Hawaii in the middle of the largest ocean, it's no doubt one of the greatest places to study marine science. And we're about to board the Koholo with Hawaii Pacific University to see how it takes the classroom outside for an unparalleled learning environment. In doing science, you need to know the process of science. You need to fully understand the scientific method. You need to be able to look at nature, make observations, and develop questions and hypotheses. And once you have that, you need the skills to conduct experiments, to test hypotheses. And then, of course, you need to analyze data. You need to be able to write. You need to be able to communicate both in written and verbal form. And so there are a lot of skills, and it's a pretty steep learning curve. Hi, I'm Eric Vetter. I'm a professor of oceanography at Hawaii Pacific University. The marine biology program at HPU. Pretty rigorous program that the students have fought their way through and uh, we've been around for about three decades now and the centerpiece of the program really has been the Koholo here which gets our students out in the field very often and of course the faculty. We're teaching the students the basics to be able to deal with the problems that are facing the world and Hawaii. So sustainability, dealing with climate change, understanding the, the science background of some of these changes that are happening to our world right now. I think we really focus on the experiential education. It's a small program relative and I think that allows us to do a lot. So not just in the classroom, but also as faculty mentoring students one-on-one -on -one or in small groups. A lot of the classes I teach are out here on the Koholo, and so we're working in small groups and really having them work on techniques that they'll use later in their careers. I'm looking to go into education. I really wanted a program where I could get in the field, understand the research, especially our senior capstone experience. We're able to control our own research projects, be the chief scientist on those projects, and I really think the leadership capabilities and lessons I learned from that are really going to help me. It's definitely given me the confidence and the power to be able to drive through and use the scientific process to the best that I can. Being able to really look into the research and look into that data and see really the patterns that we're able to pull from that. Definitely you're going to get one of the best experiences out here on the ocean. You're going to learn a lot from your professors, really have a one-on-one -on -one experience and gain the knowledge from the program. Even though I grew up down here, I didn't know much about being in the water. So this gave me the opportunity to be exposed to it and I realized I wanted to continue doing field work and I wanted to continue doing something in the water and there's so much opportunity here like it's very easy to stay home. Hawaii is great just really from easy access to the marine environment 365 days almost a year. This really gives us access to you know, uh, chemical oceanography, physical oceanography, biological and geological oceanography. We cover, we cover the bases. If anyone's interested in learning about the program, go to hpu.edu or check us out on Instagram, uh, hpu underscore koholo. This segment is sponsored by Hawaii Pacific University.